Haters come in two different kinds. The least dangerous ones who express their hatred directly, and the more dangerous ones who tell their hatred in more subtle ways. The second category is mostly friends and people you are close to. They express their hate in ways that will be difficult for you to know. These people can be scary, hence there is a need to spot them. In this video, I will show you 7 signs that you are dealing with a hater. 1. They lament about their lives regularly. Haters are depressed individuals. They portray the war is me attitude and are never happy with what they have because they compare themselves to what others have. They feel they don't match up and that others always have a better lot in life. Often, a hater will ponder what life would have been had they grown up in a different area, under different circumstances. This kind of person imagines being in someone else's shoes, thinking their life would be better. Haters never cease to whine about how lucky you are. When you acquire a feat, they don't care so much about the hard work, time and dedication you invested in that particular thing. They believe that whatever you have is as a result of luck. For instance, if you got an A in your test and show it to your hater friend, rather than congratulate you on your success, he or she will complain about their life and how they would have gotten an A or even a higher score if they had wealthy parents and stayed in a better environment. Worst case is that they may even play with your feelings so much that you begin to feel wrong about your success. 2. They are against everything. Have you ever come across a person who feels that your opinion doesn't matter, that they are always right even when they are not? Well, while this can be a temperamental attitude, it could be that you are dealing with a hater. Haters never take anyone else's side and feel if they don't like something, no one can convince them otherwise since they are the ones always right. Even when you try to show them facts, haters will never accept that you are right. They are of the habit of making people around them feel like they don't know anything. These people are also quick-tempered, don't take anything from anyone and are willing to tolerate very little before getting angry. If you try to counter their opinion, they take it personally on you. In general, haters are firmly against anything that doesn't bring them immediate happiness, even if it may not be suitable for the vast majority of other people, as long as they don't like it, they will never agree to it. 3. They are happy when you make mistakes. Do you have that friend who is always in a hurry to rub your failure on your face? Haters don't hesitate to say, you would have done it this way, or why did you not ask me before doing this or that? They are so insensitive and care little about how their unsympathetic reactions will make you feel. It takes only the slightest mistake to reveal a hater to you. Just like a mushroom after a fruitful rain, it takes the smallest error for a hater to jump happily at your face with words like, Didn't I warn you? Your last failure is a source of joy and happiness for him. They don't mind you failing as long as it will help them prove a point. Don't let this poison your world. You know where you're going and that's your way. No one will ever force you to turn away from it. 4. They spill your secrets and spread lies about you. When you trust your friend, you feel comfortable and vulnerable enough to share some or all of your deepest secrets, but what happens when that friend spills all your tea without a care in the world? It means that they are not the friend you need. There is a certain level of unforgivable betrayal that occurs when you realize your friend has been telling all of your business, a business that you thought you were sharing with someone who cared. It is even more painful when you realize that they even added some lies to the information you shared. Hitters will not miss the opportunity to talk behind you. Although, not every person who talks about you in your absence is a hater. When a person spills your secret or gossips about you in such a way that motivates others to hate you as well, then indeed, he is a hater. They will spread the purest and most magnetic rumors. They will use lies and imagination because they are angry and nothing will stop them. Drive such toxic evil people out of your life. That is the only way to stop them. 5. They like to imitate you. This is one of the easiest and most reliable ways to tell if your friend is a friend or merely a hater in disguise. Always feeling the need to compete with you, no matter how big or small the reason. It's not what a real friend does. A person who envies your career success, relationship or family, your clothes, etc. will unknowingly try to copy you. For example, if you get a promotion at work or get proposed to by your man, a hateful friend will always try to top your big news with something unique that always happened to them at one point in life. They don't allow you to take pleasure in your special moment because they are constantly comparing their life to yours. Moreover, he or she can do so blindly and obsess that he will not even notice what is happening. Thus, it is better to let this person know that he or she should find his or her place in life. Explain that he is much more likely to succeed without pretending to be someone else or modeling someone else. 6. 
try to distance you from your other friends, haters will do their best to ruin the relationship with everyone close to you and dear to you. They get jealous and angry when they see you hanging out with others. Haters understand that taking away other people's love and support will make it much easier for them to destroy you. So they will find a way to make sure you separate from your other friends. The way they do this is to try to be extra nice to you. They shower you with so much love and affection so that your attention would be directed only to them. When they consider any friends other friend wants to protect you, they try to poison your mind against that person with undesirable words. They victimize themselves and make you feel sorry for them so that you will let go of your other friends. A true friend will not try to cause a rift between you and other friends just because they want you for themselves. Only haters do that. 7. They give hypocritical compliments. Haters are flatterers. They will surround you with compliments, praise and highlights in every way possible. It will be enough to turn your back to him, and he will begin to criticize you and tell all kinds of nonsense. American author of the book, How to Win Friends and Influence People, Dale Carnegie, said, There is a difference between appreciation and flattery. The first is sincere, while the other is insincere. The first comes from the heart, while the other comes from the tooth out. The first is unselfish, while the other is a product of selfish desires. Haters practice the latter, not the former. Every average person has some people who hate him. The fact that someone hates you does not always mean that you are the one at fault. So, when you detect haters in your life, please don't blame yourself for their actions. They have the problem, not you.